Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Dan from DHTV. And today I'm gonna to be showing you how to turn on or off 5G on your iPhone 13, 13 Pro, or 13 Pro Max. And as always, if you're looking for more iPhone 13 tips, tricks, and tutorials, the full playlist link is in the description below. Let's get started. All right, now the first thing we need to do is open up our settings application. We're then gonna tap on cellular, and then we're gonna tap cellular data options. Now when we tap on this, you'll see that voice and data are set to 5G auto, and that's by default how Apple has these new iPhone 13s set up. So by having it on auto, you can already see on my phone, I am connected to a 5G network right now. But what auto actually means is that it's only going to connect to a 5G tower whenever it's close by and available and only when it's not going to significantly reduce your battery life. Now, if you didn't know, 5G will drain the battery faster than LTE and in some cases dramatically reduce that battery. So if you do decide to switch it to 5G on, that means no matter what, no matter what it's gonna do with the battery, how fast it's going to drain it, if there's a 5G tower available to you, it's going to connect to it at all times. Additionally, if you want 5G to be off at all times, you can turn it off like so and just stick to LTE that you're used to. Moving back over, there's one more feature here and it's called data mode. And when we tap on that, you can see a few more options that tie into your 5G network. So for starters, we are on standard and it tells you what standard does. This is by default, again, how Apple has the iPhone set up. So standard is going to allow automatic updates and background tasks on cellular, but limits video and FaceTime quality. If you don't mind using 5G with those options, you can set it to allow more data on 5G. And as it says right here, it's going to allow more data on 5G and may prefer 5G over Wi-Fi and use it for software updates, automatic iCloud backups, and higher quality media. Now, I strongly recommend you use this feature with caution. As it says here, some pretty big tasks could be performed that'll burn through your data plan and you might end up with some overage charges if your plan is not unlimited. The last option is the low data mode. And this one here is going to help reduce the cellular data usage by pausing automatic updates and background tasks. So it's totally up to you how you want your phone to run when it's on those 5G networks. I'm gonna leave it on standard. And for now, I'm just gonna leave my phone on the 5G auto. And that's traditionally how I used my iPhone 12 Pro. And now how I'm gonna be using my iPhone 13 Pro. So that's how you enable or disable 5G on your iPhone 13, 13 Pro or 13 Pro Max. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments below. I'm happy to help you out. And as I mentioned earlier, there's a link in the description to the full playlist of iPhone 13 tips, tricks, and tutorial videos. So definitely check those out to help you get the most out of your new iPhone. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and the bell notification box to be notified when I post new videos. I'll see you in the next one.